What's up y'all? My name is Louisa and welcome to my channel, The Ever Growing Mommy. In this video, we are just gonna jump right into it. I threw a tea party for my, my flower girls because they didn't know each other, not all of them knew each other. And I wanted to have something special for them, an activity, a gathering, so that they can get to know each other, kind of be friends, you know, as little girls. Some girls are shy, some are not, and I just wanted to get them to get comfortable with each other, and also I wanted them to feel special. I wanted this to be a special moment and experience for them, as well as um, something that I can look back out on. And so sharing behind the scenes of this tea party, thank God for my mother. She took a lot of footage and I am so grateful for her doing that. I didn't ask her, she did it on her own and this video would not be possible if it wasn't for her. So big huge shout out to my mama. Um, this is a precious moment. It's a very sweet memory and it's one of my favorites. So I hope that you enjoy this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, I would love for you to subscribe so that you don't miss any more videos of my bride vlog content. My channel is very geared towards, it's more of a vlog. I like to share a lot of the things that God is doing to help me grow and learn as a mom, as a wife, as a homemaker. Um, and so after the bride vlog series is over that's the kind of content that i like to create i like to take care of my body so i do work out a little i will actually try to work out as much as i can um, but it's very hard and so i like to share the balance of a mom life if this relates to you let's be friends subscribe to my channel and help me grow and let's just enjoy this space that youtube offers us I would love to chat with y'all in the comments below. I, I know that people get shy, but I would love to chat with you. So if you have any questions, if you have any suggestions, or if you have any comments that you'd like to leave, I welcome all of that. Okay, let's go ahead and get into this video. Thank you so much. Let's get into this video. <laughs> good morning, good morning. I didn't work out today. I decided that I'm not going to work out until this completely heals because I do not want to risk infection from the sweat um, and uh, just inflammation. And so no workout, but I'm going to keep it very low calorie today. Low, no sugar. Let me not lie. I already had sugar in my creamer, but that's it. Um, low calorie, um, basically going to be fasting until I can start working back out again. But I wanted to come on here and say good morning. I'm alive. <laughs> Thank God I got some rest. I slept so good last night. And um, now I've got to work. <laughs> Y'all have a good day. This is my precious grandson. Back in this time, I used to watch him during my work days, and so he, I had him like kind of caged in. I feel so bad looking back at it now, but he is such a sweetheart. He was a good boy, and um, I enjoyed these days that I got to spend with him. I am going through all this stuff in my office that um, I have my, it's like a storage right now for well one for my decorations for the house I haven't put up yet but also all things wedding and flower girl and bridal shower I mean bridesmaids and this is actually for the wedding we are using this for the wedding it lights up and then my checkoff list so I'm about to go through all this stuff oh this is for my thanksgiving Y'all want to know why I have so much anxiety? Let me just share. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's not funny, but it's a for real life going on here. But this, I've been wanting really the exact same thing I saw at Hobby Lobby. Um, and I got it for a fraction of the price at Ross. And I also got another 20% off because of this guy right here and then there's other pieces that are missing but I don't mind that that doesn't bother me but look how pretty it is oh my goodness it's so long so I'm excited I'm gonna use this for Thanksgiving when my family is in town from Colorado 
I'll show y'all here in a little bit what all I got going on. Right now, I have the masa. I have a lot going on today. I have not worked out. I didn't work out yesterday um, because I was having my midlife crisis, I think. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm making a joke of it, but it's not funny. Um, I, didn't, I haven't worked out yet because I went to bed at 3.30 this morning and then I woke up like at, I think it was like 7. I had to take the dogs out and then um, let them eat and then I went back to sleep and woke up back up at 9 o'clock. Because I had to start wrapping the tamales. Anyways, the flavors in it. Anyways, long story. But tomorrow I have my flower girl um, tea party. And I just thought of having a tea party so that they can all meet each other. Um, I have gift bags for them. I have... Um, I've got to lay out all the stuff that I need for their party. And my sweet maid of honor actually did most of the work i just got to get it all together but i want to show y'all what i have for them because it's so cute it's so cute and then um next weekend is my bachelorette party and then i'm gonna have a little party for my grandson because he's turning two um but i need to unbag all this stuff and kind of like make a list because after I do this, I'm going to go do the masa and I'm going to start spreading the rest of the meat that I have. And I'm going to make a trip to Walmart, go get another um, pork roast, and then get some things that I need because I'm making frijoles rancheros and some macaroni for a um, Halloween party tonight. And uh, yeah, I got to get all that done. So let me um, break it down and show y'all what I got. Okay, now I'm just kind of going through all the things that I um, gifted the flower girls. They all had a headpiece. They all had a mini unicorn purse. Of course, their flower basket. I gave them pearls for jewelry and a bath bomb and a little hula skirt to make their dress puffy. This was their flower girl proposal. It was a cute little um, bag with this box inside. It had the proposal. Um, and a gift inside of that each one received that these are the place settings I got them on Amazon and then um, and these white tray setup dishes my bridesmaid um, my maid of honor sorry she purchased those off of Amazon and all of this is what we used for the tea party Okay, I want to share with y'all, this is my, for my bridesmaids, their bag that I'm giving them. I need to get um, more socks and more of these. Okay, right now my office is a complete disaster. <laughs> I was starting, I went through my um, tea party stuff and I was starting to go through the bridesmaid because I have bridesmaid bags that I'm giving my bridesmaids. <sighs> I'm just going to stop right now. <laughs> Turn around and walk away and leave everything where it's at. I think going over the um, uh, tea party stuff was enough for me. So I'm going to end it at that. But this is what my office looks like right now. I've got flower girl dresses, I've got house decor, wedding, wedding, all this is wedding stuff, and then, look at that, it's just a complete disaster, so I'm going to close this door, walk away, and go finish my um, tamales, and then um, I'm going to go to Walmart. <sighs> I'd like to go to Hobby Lobby um, and Party City, but I don't think I'm going to be able to. I'm going to have to just go to Walmart. That'll be okay. I wanted to get a game for these girls. I think everything that I want to get, I can get at Walmart. I want to get um, a teacup that they can paint um, and make it their own, kind of give them something to do, like an activity. So we'll see what I find at um, Hobby Lobby. 
but I'm going to have them tomorrow practice how to walk down the aisle with a flower basket. I'm going to show them how to walk behind each other and so that when we go to rehearsals, it will be a piece of cake. It won't be like a struggle to get these girls to, you know, we're shy as little girls. We get shy. So hopefully I can knock that in the butt. Is that how you say it? <laughs> um, I do. I am going to work on my thank you cards. I haven't sent out thank you cards for my bridal shower, but I'm going to try to do that on tomorrow night after the um, tea party is over. That is my plan to do that and to also kind of organize my office um, because by that, by after the tea party, a lot of the stuff should be gone because the tea party will be over. So I think that's it. Yeah, I'm going to walk away. <laughs> Okay, it is the day of the party. All of these sweets, I don't remember what store we got them from, um, but my maid of honor had the cutest idea of cutting out little sandwiches and hearts, and that's what you see on these trays. I made a special place for each girl and myself. Um, one of the girls, unfortunately, was not able to make it, but it was okay. It still worked out. Had a little setup for their gifts. It was very simple. Um, I put a white sheet over my workstation so it wouldn't be an eyesore. Um, and this is the little area that I made for them in my office. We obviously got it all cleaned out. And then we tried on flower dresses. These dresses were the perfect dress. Um, I searched for them on Am I'm sorry, on Google. I just searched princess flower girl dress and these are the dresses that popped up and they were everything I envisioned for my flower girls these are my cute little sweet flower girls they had such a cute little giggly time we talked we introduced ourselves we told our name what grade we were in and just a little bit about ourselves they really had a good time and um, this one is my niece and she got a little emotional when she opened her gift bag and it was so sweet. This is my other niece and these two are my, my, one of my good friend's daughters. I really felt like this was the perfect idea to get these girls to know each other, to get comfortable with each other so that when the time came for them to do their duty, they they were able to support each other and they did such an amazing job now they're opening their little gifts and they're all excited to see of course what's inside and um as you can see they just enjoyed this part of the tea party if you are having flower girls and they don't all know each other i think this is a great idea for you um to be able to get them to know each other and also a way to set the tone for their minds and their hearts give them vision that they are going to be princesses they are now getting ready to practice their walk this is where i'm going to stand with my little prince right here okay okay and when y'all come down hold on when y'all come down you're going to be first, you're going to come right here, and you're going to sit like a little princess with crisscross applesauce, just like that. And then you're going to sit, and then you're going to sit. And we're going to do this at the church. He's the invisible man. <laughs> Honey. Because you're invisible right now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. I'll be the prince. Okay, Joey. Johnny's going to pretend to be the prince. Okay, here we go. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this is the prince my, invisible. <laughs> this is going to be my prince. Look that way. Look that way. Okay. And y'all are going to sit right here at the church. Okay? At the bottom of the steps. Ooh. There you there go. There you go. Yes. Okay, can y'all do that? Yeah. Can you curtsy, girls? Okay. Let's see. Yes, you have to. So you're going to do a little bow. Pull it all the way out. Pull your dress all the way out. There you go. There you go. Just like that. 
There you go. Mm -hmm. Curtsy, there you go. Mm -hmm. Now practice walking, okay? Come on, girls. Listen, <laughs> oh, you're gonna watch me the first time, okay? I'm gonna practice the first time, so you'll stand right here. Y'all wait and watch walk. how she does it. Okay. Watch her. Okay, I do want to give a disclaimer. How we practice is not how it ended up being at the chapel. Obviously, this was not going, this was just going off the top of my head, but everything worked out perfectly at the chapel. I just wanted them to have an idea in their mind of what to expect. And I'm so glad that we had this moment because um, I kind of don't know how it would have ended up if we didn't have this whole tea party gathering experience for them to practice. <music> Thank you. 